Hi Diva Laversa, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kay Young, as in Young Forever. In today's video, I'll be making a Yen Runner picture frame. Right. But before we get into our DIY, my inspiration for today, the tongue has no bones, but it is strong enough to break a heart. So be careful of your words. With that said, guys, let's go. You know what? DIY. Okay, my diva lovers. So this is what we're going to work with today. We got some metal bottle cap from the Dollar Tree and they're in the crafter square so what I'm gonna do with these today is to make some picture frame so I have I got five of them so I'm going to I want to paint them in white Oh, I forgot my paint. We're going to use the Waverly white chalk paint. I'm going to paint them inside. Oh, I want to remove these. I'm going to put them back, but I want to remove them first. I don't think I want that color either. Anyway, we're going to paint them. I'm going to put a picture inside, so I don't think I should paint the inside. I don't want the, the, the point is I don't want this metal color that I'm looking at. These are for the farmhouse lovers. So I'm going to paint around the edge and I'll necessarily paint in the middle because that's where I'm going to put the picture. I was thinking of putting it on this side but you won't see the effect of the, um, of the cap. it's going to hang on the wall so you won't really see the back so the edges of the cap and it just looked like a cap from one of the drinks bottle or beer bottle but just bigger all right I'm gonna do all five of them. Okay, my diva lovers, I went ahead and whew, I was getting ahead. I was getting ahead. So, anyway, as you can see, I paint the inside and I'm using my grandchildren pictures, which I printed. Which didn't come out good, but anywho, we're gonna go with it. Okay, so all I did was print some picture from my um printer, and I'm gonna stick it down. Make sure we have this right here. I'm gonna stick it down in here. Yeah. I think I'm going to let it dry a little bit because the first one I did it started to bubble this is what it looked like so far this is the first one I did I put some 
mud podge over it and it it starts to bubble so I believe I have to let it dry first and then so I'm gonna continue oh. I'm gonna spray the bottom I'm gonna put a little bit of mud podge So I can put the picture in. I'm going to put it down. Let it dry. gonna finish the rest okay my divas I tell you I'm I tell you I'm going ahead now as you can see it's not fully dry I believe I put on too much mud pot on this but this is the look I want to go for And these are not fully dry either but that's the look I'm going for so in the meantime it's drying what I'm gonna do I got some rope so I'm gonna Put it back through the oil that the original because I want to do like a train want to do like a train hanger it's a pretty it's a picture frame but I want to do it like a train train runner right that's what I want to say a train runner want to glue the end of this and then run it back through the oil which I don't think I don't believe this is working but let's see no I forget something smaller <sighs> I don't like the rope that comes with it I don't like this rope this can go back through it with ease see but I don't like this rope I'm gonna look something different to run this through okay my diva glamours so what I decided to do is put the rope in the back so it's gonna look like this so we have a train going Okay, as you guys have been watching, you know I love my lights. 
and everything I'm doing. I need some light. So, I'm going to use these lights. You know, these lights come from the Dollar Tree. So, what I believe I'm going to do. First, I need some battery, right? So, let's see. How is this going to work? And my Diva Glamours, if you're new here, thank you for stopping by. I really, really, truly appreciate you guys. And for my subscribers, thank you for subscribing. And thank you for watching. So what I'm going to do, I believe, let's see. I'm going to string these. String these. Oh, I think it's too short. I think it's too short. <clears throat> I believe it's too short. Okay, let's see. So, say we have one here, all right, and this go in the back, and then we're gonna come up here. You guys can see, right? No, that's not gonna work. No, that's not gonna work. It's too short. So let's go another way. These came with some clear pins. So let's pin it and see how it looks on the pin. I mean, this wasn't part of the DIY. But I say, guess what? You need some lights. Yeah, you need some lights. So I need each pen to get light. Okay, my queen dolls. I decided to put some rhinestone around the edge. Because it wouldn't be glamour without some rhinestone. And I get the lights going. So all I'm doing now is put the rhinestones around it. To give it some glamour. finish this off and show you the finished product If you enjoyed that video don't forget to you know what give me a thumbs up like subscribe 
turn your notification bell on so each time I upload you'll be the what first one to know with all of that said guys ciao be blessed be safe and I'll see you in my next video